Amanda Bynes spotted in rare outing amid Nickelodeon docu-series Fallout Amanda Bynes, the former child star, has recently surfaced in a rare public appearance alongside a friend following the airing of the HBO Max docu-series, Quiet on Set, which delves into the darker aspects of early 2000s Nickelodeon. The docu-series, released earlier this month, has stirred discussions among fans prompting them to urge Bynes to share her own experiences from her time at Nickelodeon. In this revealing series, actor Drake Bell, now 37, bravely opened up about the abuse he endured during his tenure on The Amanda Show. Despite being the focal point of the show, 37-year-old Amanda Bynes has yet to issue any formal statements following the release of the Max series. Speculation has swirled regarding the circumstances surrounding Blind's departure from the spotlight and her alleged experiences behind the scenes with producer Dan Schneider, although nothing has been officially confirmed. Transitioning away from acting, Bynes has embarked on other ventures such as podcasting and authoring a coffee table book, as evidenced by her Instagram updates. Furthermore, she has been actively spending time with friends, notably Liam Powelson as seen in recent social media posts. A recent Instagram photo depicted Bynes and Powell's and seated together at a small table, exuding a sense of camaraderie. Eager fans flooded the comments section of Bynes' post, imploring her to share her Nickelodeon anecdotes. One fan urged her to pen her life story, while another encouraged her to speak her truth in her own time, acknowledging her reservoir of untold stories from her days at Nick. The Quiet On Set docuseries casts a spotlight on the serious allegations levied against Dan Schneider for his treatment of women and child actors on set. Through interviews with former child actors and employees, the series sheds light on the purported toxicity of the working environment. Despite the scrutiny directed towards Schneider and others, including Brian Peck, who pleaded guilty to charges of sexual abuse, Schneider vehemently denies all allegations, deflecting blame onto Nickelodeon and asserting that any inappropriate content would have been promptly removed from airing. As the fallout from the docuseries continues to unfold, Bynes remains a figure of interest, with fans eagerly awaiting any insight she may offer into her tumultuous Nickelodeon days. While she has yet to make any official statements regarding her time on Nick, her intermittent appearances serve as a reminder of her enduring presence in the public eye.